Thanks, Nick. And called in as one of the heavyweights of the national hunt season makes his reappearance. Five Dream for Company being called in. So they're being called in. Approaching the tape set steadily, but they're sent on their way, often racing for the Sporting Bet long distance hurdle race. And the first two home 12 months ago fill the first two positions. Five Dream and Big Bucks on the run towards the first. And uh, they are over flight number one, clear of Fox Appeal and Rev de Civila gives that hurdle plenty of daylight. Uh, back in fourth place, having been competing over fences for the majority of the recent runs, Five Dream and Big Bucks at the second. Big Bucks just putting himself right there. In third is Fox Appeal, who settled pretty well, can be keen in his races, and uh, is in third place early on, about uh, three to four lengths behind the front pair, and Rev de Civila at the rear of the field. So they're turning at the far end and making their longest journey now before they encounter flight number three. And Big Bucks alongside Five Dream, who's kept him company, albeit at a respectful distance at the finish in several of the recent races. Fox Appeal in third place. So he can just be a little bit keen and is still marginally keen, but not as bad as Fox Appeal can be. And Rev de Civila is at the rear of the field. So the front two, just ensuring this is not a complete dawdle. They've got track position of about six to seven lengths over Fox Appeal and Rev de Civila. As Big Bucks alongside Five Dream turns back towards flight number three. Third place, Fox Appeal and Rev de Civila both held up. Plenty of prize money on offer for the minor positions here. Even if they can't ruffle the feathers of Big Bucks, who jumps that well with Five Dream, whose rider Ryan Marn just checks where the other two are. You will see that Fox Appeal is about six to eight lengths back in third with a further couple of lengths back to Rev de Civila as they make their way up the home straight. Five Dream on the outside of Big Bucks as they approach flight number four. Pop over it from Fox Appeal and Rev de Civila. There's been very little change in the play as they make their way up the home straight. Five Dream, who's looking to end a sequence in terms of not visiting the winners' enclosure since 2009, but say has amassed useful prize money on occasions in the interim, alongside Big Bucks, who is right alongside with Fox Appeal in third and Rev de Civila. So very little change from the outset here. Big Bucks just uh, lobbing along. Big Bucks, the winner of 22 races in all, and on this winning streak of 17. Dwarfing on the near side, Five Dream as they make their way up past us. Fox Appeal being kept in close enough attendance is four lengths away. Fox Appeal successful at Kempton last time and a horse that's progressed through handicaps and having a crack at the title holder here in third place and Reb de Civila in uh, fourth as they make their turn that carries them out onto the far side. Reb de Civila winner here of a grade one over hurdles. The Shallow hurdle in very heavy ground when he defeated no less than Finian's Rainbow in the process. So a smart hurdler at his best as Big Bucks and Five Dream make their way towards the first down the back. Still about six lengths clear of Fox Appeal. Rev de Civila wasn't as good there. That's the first semblance of mistake by any of the runners. It drops him a further three to four lengths behind Fox Appeal as Big Bucks and Five Dream just content to sit alongside each other as they come towards the next and five dream from big bucks fox appeal six lengths away rev de civila so they've just about completed a circuit and so far it's been conducted almost like a little bit of work at paul nichols ditch it stable with big bucks alongside five dream all the time ryan Marn is just checking and no doubt reporting as to where the others are with fox appeal four lengths away and rev de civila as they reach the next so the third horse just closing up marginally here as they race towards the last on the far side. This will be four from the finish, but still a long journey after it before they take the three up the home straight. Big Bucks on the inside of Five Dream. Fox Appeal moving through closer, now in third place. And Rev de Civila at the back of the field. Again, Ryan Marn on Five Dream just casts a glance backwards. Big Bucks still travelling powerfully alongside. And uh, Fox Appeal in third place. Rev de Civila in fourth. Both those riders yet to show too much in the way of anxiety, but the front two stretching on towards the third last. And out in front, still the Nichols pair. Five Dream on the outside, still travels well from Big Bucks. They haven't gone a frenetic gallop, 
Fox Appeal in third. A slap down the neck for Reb to Civila, just suggesting for the first time that maybe the pace is slightly increasing as the Nichols pair swing back towards home. Fox Appeal in third is four lengths away, and Reb to Civila. And once again, out in front, Five Dream, Ryan Marn in danger of repetitive strain injury, casting his neck down so many times during the course of this race, but the back two behind is just struggling to get to the front pair here as they race towards the third last. Five Dream on the left, Big Bucks on the right. They're over from Fox Appeal, who stepped through that in third place and is shaken up to try and launch a challenge. Now it's Ruby Walsh's chance to have a look around. He'll see Five Dream, his old adversary. Fox Appeal's being brought deliberately over to the near side, maybe to try and jump Big Bucks, if at all possible. But Ruby Walsh still feels very happy indeed as they take two from home. Five Dream in second, Fox Appeal in third place, blundered there. Back in fourth is Rev de Civil and racing down towards the final flight of hurdles and Big Bucks extending away Fox Appeal trying to grind his way past Five Dream and Rev de Civila they're having a fight like so many before them for place prize money and Big Bucks comes into the last and pops over it clear and Big Bucks from Fox Appeal and Big Bucks making his way past the scene of his departure in the 2008 Hennessy which changed the course of staying hurdling history because here Big Bucks one of the heavyweight stars of the national hunt season makes a triumphant return without breaking sweat. Fourth success in this race, 18 straight, unbeaten since that capsize in the Hennessy. Big Bucks is back and back as good as ever. In second, Rev de Civila, Fox Appeal was third, and Five Dream on this occasion ran out of puff and could only finish fourth. Oh Number one, Big Bucks. Big Bucks Four. has won. <laughs> three. 12 to 1 on favourite, dispatches three inferiors with no fuss. Simple as that.